In the Bag is definitely a very sweet Disney cartoon. Ordinarily, I'm not really a fan of Humphrey the Bear, but actually I quite liked him. This is a 1956 cartoon directed by Jack Hanna with a story by David Dutige and Albertino. And we have our usual brilliant voice cast um, with James McDonald as Humphrey the Bear and Bill Thompson as the Ranger. And the Ranger instructs the bears to clean up the park because the tourists have left this horrific mess behind and sure it's maybe not the bear's responsibility to do this but they do it anyway and Humphrey is the main one tidying everything up but as soon as he puts things into the bag something happens to make the trash go out of the bag and cause the litter all over again for example a gust of wind or something tears the bag and he has to keep starting all over again and just when you think he's finished tidying up it happens all over again and I can't help thinking that the monotony of constantly tidying up trash would have been saved if humans had just done the right thing and not littered. And that's obviously a message that's in this one, but it's also quite fun. Apparently, the song in this, there is a song, uh, and apparently it was so popular that, this is according to Wikipedia, that they actually released it as a single and it's called The Humphrey Hop. So it's worth checking out just to listen to the music. Certainly it's very engaging. Is it engaging enough to make me want to go and tidy up other people's trash? Not necessarily, but I did think that it was quite fun. I kind of thought, okay, how are they going to ruin Humphrey's efforts this time? And the last the, the last thing that ruins his efforts I thought was pretty clever and I didn't see it coming. So I rather liked it. It's well animated, the music is good, the messages in it are not completely in your face but they're definitely there, definitely just don't leave litter around. And it's definitely one that I, I had some fun watching. If you're a fan of Humphrey the Bear, I think you'll like it, but even if, like me, you don't particularly love the character, I still think it's worth checking out. I definitely had some fun with it.